What's up? I'm going to show you guys how to fix a keychain light that doesn't seem to work anymore. Um, what I mean by that is if you take a keychain light and you squeeze it, it works. But when you go and turn on the switch, it doesn't work. So uh, I'm going to fix. I'm going to show you guys how to mod how to modify it so that it does work. Okay. Um, first thing you got to do is, of course, you got to have a keychain light that doesn't work. And then you're going to need a small screwdriver. Um, first part, take off all the screws. So I'm going to do that now. Okay, so now that all the screws are off, we can uh, start to disassemble the, uh, the keychain light. Okay, with the screw um, end on top, um, I'm going to have you pull off the top part of it. Just like that, it comes off kind of like a, you know, like a latch, a door, okay? Okay, uh, pay attention to the battery. Notice that the positives are on the top. So take out the batteries, put those aside. Um, the part that's going to fix the switch is uh, making a modification to the LED light. So I'm not sure if you can see that. Um, if you can see that, that's, that's good. You're looking at just a regular LED um, with two prongs. Okay, notice the top prong is smaller than the bottom prong. The bottom prong, the longer one, is is the one that actually sits on top of the switch. So um, take note of that. The, um, the first thing you want to do is uh, basically straighten it out. Make sure that they're, you know, they're parallel. Make sure it looks like that. Okay. To fix it, you're going to want to make this long side right here have a little kink in the end. And... Um, I have a graphic to show you. Don't laugh, but um, I want to show you my little my little uh, drawing that I did for you guys. Basically, I'm just going to take my thumb. I'm going to place it right here, and I'm just going to bend it. See that? All I did was put a little bend in the bottom prong, the longer prong. So um, let me show you my picture. Maybe help you guys out a little bit. Okay, I hope you guys can see that. Um, basically, this is not the LED when you first took it out. So it's in normal, normal mode, right? No, we don't want that, okay? We want yes. We want fixed mode, which is uh, you put a little bend here. So, um, as you can see, kind of looks like the, the picture. Alright, anyways. Um, okay, so um, now that you have your LED... Um, bent. You're going to place it back onto um, great, I just jacked up the switch here. Hold on. Okay, so you take your LED you're going to put it back into the bottom case where the switch is. Okay, try to keep the switch in its place. Just like that. See how I did that? I put it back in the case but notice it kind of has room to move left or right. Push it to the um, well towards you. Okay, pull the um, this towards you. I hope you can you can see that. Put this back in there. Okay, take your batteries. You're gonna slide it back in there, just like that. Then you're gonna take the top part and you're gonna put it back on. It's a little sensitive right now because we made that little bend, but it'll it'll kind of fix itself once you. Um, put the screws back on. So I'm going to put the screws back on and um, I'm not going to put all of them on because it just takes too long. I'm just going to show you really quick how that little bend actually fixed the LED light. 
Okay, so as you can see, it works when I squeeze it, but now when I hit the switch, it also works. So um, that's pretty much how you um, fix a keychain light that seems to have stopped working, like the switch stopped working. Um, if you have any other questions, you can feel free to uh, email me, you can message me on AIM, or you can call me, uh, just visit the site, my number's posted. Um, and so yeah, just uh, fix it and let me know.